What's new in Falcon 4.35? Grosser! Chaff, Grosser! Chaff, New update! Grosser! You can find 4.35 at the Benchmark Sims website. Let's take a look at the change log. Alright, listen up. That's right, listen up. Quite a few changes, updates, new aircraft, JF-17. Updates to flight models. So let's take up the F-16, Block 52. Radio comms are simplified yet accurate. Not overly complicated like in that other flight sim. We just got our taxi clearance. We're going to head up to the runway. And we're going to fly a multi-flight mission to take out a nuclear power plant in the north. Contact tower for takeoff. Switch to three five three one zero. So let's take a look at pre mission briefings. It's pretty much the same. And you pick your flight. And we're going to do the strike mission. All right, listen up. Now here's where we'll get our briefing, our target. Our flights. And here's our comms ladder. AWACS on Uniform 6, or Victor 6. And we're going to be on Uniform 15 in our flight. There's the tower frequencies. All right, with that, we'll get takeoff clearance. Warhawk 4, four ship, F 16s, ready for departure. Warhawk 4, Haymi Tower, wing 150 at 8 knots, runway 20 left. You are cleared for takeoff. All right, we're good to go. Setting up for liftoff. Let's switch off our nose wheel steering. Throttle up with the brake on. Brake off and powering down the runway. And you can feel the rumble. All right, lift off. And the game flights records through a ACMI. You just press the F key to start recording. And here's our takeoff for review. The resolution is, is much less than in game, uh, but it has a forensic value. You can keep track of any item on the map. Great for a review. All right, let's get back to the mission. We're on station. Max 
Magic, 7, Warhawk, 4-1, request picture. Warhawk, 4-1, Magic, 7, picture clear. And we just got a picture from AWACS. On our comms one, channel six. We've also got data link to everyone in our flight. In our right MFD, we have our situational picture. Threat rings from SAMS. That's our HSI, right MFD. And we want to get all our weapons off just outside of the SAM threat area. And we're armed with two JSSM standoff missiles. AGMs with GPS, radar, and internal motors. The enemy has Warhawk 43, attack target, bullseye 3603. Three. The welcome. equivalent of a modern Four, S300 welcome. surface to air missile system. But we have An assisting flight of AWACS. Electronic warfare. SAM suppression seed. And a high aircraft cover from fighter cover from F 15s. Magic 7, be advised, hostile launch activity detected. Bullseye 0, 5, 0, 1, 5. And our AWACS is picking up hostile aircraft. Let's move up forward. Cruiser. Warhawk 4-2, attack target, bullseye 3 six, zero, And we're three, distributing targets to our wingmen. Two, welcome. And launching. Bruiser. On an enemy. Magic, nuclear seven, power Warhawk, generating four, station. One. Request picture. Warhawk 4-1, magic. Seven, our target is the reactor. Bullseye 4 zero. Eight for Bruiser. 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 Bruiser.
We can see the target area has already taken some hits. And we're right on target. Reactors destroyed. Four in position. Alright, let's go back to the ACMI and back to forensics. We can follow up on the enemy target area, what kind of damage occurred. Now let's take her in. We've got a successful mission, it looks that way. Um, game wise, the feel of it is just a little bit a little bit sharper in BMS 4.35 uh, you're still not going to get the eye candy that you have in DCS um, but this is this is a noticeable improvement get a better feel for the game and we're lining up for final well, uh, four, one. turn right heading 245 maintain 300 zero, zero knots Descend to 3000, runway 20 right. In older versions of BMS, I found the landing sequence to be a little squirrely, and 4.35, it's, it's more refined, less play, a little bit more accurate with the controls. Turn right heading 270, climb to 4000. So we've got a good lineup. Turn right heading 205, hold 3000. Vectors to final, runway 20 right. Slightly nose up. Just a little bit of throttle. Wah -wah, 4 4, descend to 3000. And touchdown. 300 knots, runway 20 right. Alright, let's take a look through the ACMI, the exterior view of the landing. And touchdown. All right, guys, let's check our score. And we got a mission success. Well guys, BMS 4.35, a pretty good improvement. And if you're not into pay to play or have a slower uh, machine with less um, graphic capability, uh, BMS is a great alternative. Again, no pay to play. Um, you just have to get the original game which you can get on Steam for under $10. Well, guys, I hope you like this flight. Thanks for watching.